Welcome back, everyone. I have worked for Evening Magazine for six years now and worked with that man right back there, Daryl yeah. Benedict. That's right. We travel all around the world together, and we have one thing in common. We both suffer from low blood sugar. So Daryl always carries with him this little cooler. And in it, we have our, our Cliff Bars and we've got our apples because we know that if we don't keep our blood sugar up, we can get very, very cranky. Yeah. And one time, we were shooting a show over at the Edgewater Hotel, and I got to admit it. I admit it. I lost my temper. Some just, way to you know, just keep up. it from doing that? No, I just hit my foot on it. Can you see this? Yeah, I can't, you, get rid of that. That bird thing up there in the back. There, just stick it up there that way. Okay. Just here we go, here we go. Ready? Yeah. <clears throat> so, what's it like living in a house with more than 150 monkeys? John Stoplitz about to find out. Now, we're going to have to do it again. you got a big piece of something on your shoulder there. Right? All right. You know what? Let's just take... Why don't we do this? Let's... Uh, yeah, well, while you're up, hey, how about that bird is just not working for me, you know? I don't know what it is. That... Is that better? Well, yeah, but also the, the plant, there's like a couple of leaves that are hanging down. What? Well, you don't have to wait. Oh, that's good. That's nice. Okay. Now, now that works really well. That's good. Okay. Come on. 